One of the best ways to practice when you can't get a hold of your instrument is to read a good book. Get a music dictionary and keep it in your bathroom. In order to build up your knowledge about music in general, things like music theory, music history, all of those little things that really don't have anything at all to do with physically playing the instrument, you can actually read your way into better playing. Any sort of music book is a good book, but I will make some specific recommendations about some books that helped me personally tremendously on the topic of practice. And the first one is a little book called Music Theory Made Easy by David Harp. I strongly recommend that. The next book that I found very useful was a book called Effortless Mastery by Kenny Warner. The most recent book that I've read that has been incredibly insightful about the whole notion of learning to play any instrument is a book called The Music Lesson by Victor Wooten. Reading a good book is an excellent way to improve your overall playing. Another book that I really recommend that everybody have is a music dictionary. Uh, it doesn't have to be a big, thick, complicated music dictionary, just a simple one so that if you hear people talking about things and you don't know what they're talking about, you can always look it up. And if you want to learn something new every day, get a music dictionary and keep it in your bathroom. You'll always have a few minutes every day to explore that and find some new definitions and some new terms. See the equipment our pros use at the best prices anywhere online. Support small business and save.